Hi, I'm Joe from Wacom. I'm going to show you how to set up and install your Bamboo Fun with your PC or laptop. First, make sure all applications are closed. If you're using antivirus programs, disable it for now. If you're unfamiliar with disabling antivirus software, you may need to consult your user's manual or the help for the software you use. Frequently, you'll have an icon near your clock in the lower right portion of the taskbar. This icon will represent the antivirus software that you have installed. You can usually right-click on the icon and then choose to disable it. Now let's get your tablet connected and powered up. Take the USB cable that came with your Bamboo Fun and connect it to any open USB port on your computer. A direct connection between your Bamboo Fun and the computer is optimal because it provides stable communication and power to your tablet. For the sake of testing or support, this will be one of the first questions we ask as frequently hubs and docking stations will fail to provide adequate communication or power. The other end of the USB cable goes into your Bamboo Fun tablet like this. Be sure that the plug is pushed all the way in. In many cases it will resist about halfway and until you get a good connection it's unlikely that the tablet will work. If at this point the lights on the tablet don't come on, my first suggestion would be to try any other USB port. If that doesn't work, since it's more likely that a cable will fail than the tablet itself, try any mini USB cable, like the ones that come with most digital cameras. At this point, your pen and mouse should start functioning, but we still need to install the tablet driver. The driver is software that interprets the information coming from the tablet and enables most of the features and functions. Because Wacom updates its drivers frequently, your best bet is always to go to the Wacom website for the most recent driver. Next, let's install the driver. Click on the driver link, then select Primary Download on the following page. I strongly recommend you save it to your desktop before you install it. You can always throw it away when you're done, or return to Wacom's website and get the latest driver whenever you need it. If you're running XP Service Pack 2 or earlier, you may see a series of hardware wizards pop up windows asking questions during the install. Please ignore them. They should go away on their own, and interacting with them can cause problems down the line. Once the install is complete, your Bamboo Fun should be ready to go. You can verify this by going to your Start menu, All Programs, and then you should see Pen Tablet listed. Then you can feel sure that the driver was successfully installed. Now you can try using the pen to see how it maps to your screen. You can customize how the tablet works by changing preferences in the control panel. And to learn more about this, simply watch some of our other videos. And if you have other technical or customer care questions, visit us at Wacom.com. <laughs>